ប្រធានគណៈបានអរគុណព្រះអង្គសម្រាប់សេចក្តីយំណរដែលយើងមានហើយក៏សូមគ្រប់បញ្ជើញដល់លោកជូមានសេរីលោកគឺជាតាន់បណ្ឌិតនៅមន្ទីរជាបាល់ថ្មីភ្នំពេញសូមគ្រប់លោក
hay dương thử tay riêng vì cả anh phải tu bảo đòi miên này strong conviction and communication and obedience tam dạ ở đằng trước bác ông nơi chỉ muối tam dạ đằng trước ba tha Obedience is the best way to experience God. Without listening to God, we cannot obey God. When we hear from God through the Bible, God gives a strong desire and power to obey God. So, so God bless us to be able to obey Him. Obedience without our own effort is impossible. When we listen to God, God gives strong desire and power to obey God. So we can experience God. Did you experience God during uh, three days, two days? Who? Okay, praise okay. God. Okay, praise okay. God. Okay. okay. Maybe you already experienced God, but you, you cannot recognize. Do you want to experience God in your daily life? Amen. Amen. God listens to your voice. God is pleased with you. Today is the last day of the conference. Yeah, today is a. You have still opportunity. To, to concentrate on God. To experience God. When you have time, just to uh, seek God and uh, focus on God. You just pray to God. Actually, James 4 2. I am uh, going to share about how to pray proper, properly. Okay? Okay. Through so proper prayer, you can experience God. Many people pray to God. Nothing happened. Okay. 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 Why cannot we get whatever we want? Why? Why? God is all, God loves you so much and he really wants to give anything, everything for you. Sometimes we really want something. We need something. We try to do our best. James mentioned that we try to get something, even killing others and lying to others. Even some, if someone has, uh, has something that we don't have, at that time we, we are jealousy. In spite of that, we cannot get, we cannot get what we want to have. 
Yeah, I know you want many things, okay? God can give you. Now it's the God is asking you, what do you want? What do you want me to do? Hear the Bible. Why we, we cannot? Why we cannot have what we want to have? Why? Why? We don't pray to God. We will pray to God. God will give. So many people pray to God, but they cannot any response from God. How about your prayer? When you pray to God, you get something and uh, feedback and response from God? Yes? Yes? Hallelujah. Oh. Keep on going. So now is that I'm going to uh, about powerful and true prayer. What's the power prayer? Power prayer can move God to do something for earth. I want to share four points of power prayer. Number one is the part of prayer is talking with God. Okay, Not just the talking to God. Sometimes we talk to God without any sense of God's presence. So sometimes we frustrate. Sometimes disappoint. Sometimes our prayer is boring. So we stop, stop praying. When we, when we pray to God, and you can experience God, and get answers, answers from God. How much joy we can have? You pray and you can sense God is with you and listen to you. Yes, yes, when you pray to God, God gives answers to you. Heavenly Father, and God say, yes, my son, my hmm. daughter. Yes, my son, my 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 daughter. God will say, yes, I nearly want to miss you. I, I, I miss you. I nearly want to see you. This is a very beautiful conversation. This is a proper prayer. So, in order to uh, talk with God, we should strong conviction that uh, strong conviction about God's presence with us. When we pray, we, when we pray to God, we should know that God we stand before God. God is listening to listening to you. How can we know? How can we know we stand before God? How can you know God is listening to you? The only way is the only by faith. God promised. Psalm 145, 18. 
กปีตนงกางจมปุกมรอยสายพรำคอดับผมไว The Lord is close to all who call on Him ป้องในเจ็ดอ่อนเนี่ยน่าได้ใส่เราตรง Yes to all who call Him call on Him sincerely ปฏิบัติการดอลเนี่ยน่าได้ใส่ให้ตรงได้อ่อนเป็นเจ็ด God already promised นี่คือจิตสิกไอสันยาระบอกเลย When we call on God ในเปรียงใส่เราตรง When we pray to God God will be close to us. So we can have a strong conviction by faith. We also have a strong conviction through experience. God nearly, easily uh, do you when you pray to God. You can experience God when you pray to God. When you experience God in your prayer, you can have a strong conviction. God is near. God is near with me. When I pray to God. When I go to bed, when I get up, when I go to school, when I face difficulties, when I feel sorrow, when I have a joy, anytime you can sense that God is always with us. You can experience God in your prayer. When you experience God, you can have a strong conviction. Actually, I, when I was a university university student, I lost some uh, got so much. Because of uh, because I know His love for me. I really want to love Him. So I spent much time on praying and reading the Bible. Even I was involved actively in churchy. Uh, during the weekday, I uh, served God in my campus. During weekend, I visit my hometown for almost two hours, three hours. Ngày sáng ngày tết cứ khi ông từ sọc cầm nát ra bọc nhóm. Spend during the weekend to serve God in my church. Cứ bầm ra bọc ăn nơi phe bề hiên sọc cầm nát khi nhóm. So someday I felt some. Something, some thought or occurred to me. I served God so much. I was so tired of serving God in on campus and in my hometown. Enjoy, I couldn't enjoy. Uh, I couldn't experience joy and peace and uh, abundant life in my life. I couldn't experience joy and peace and abundant life in my life. I couldn't experience life in my uh, in my own life, I felt emptiness. Sometimes very lonesomeness. Desperation. Bitterness. Not much joy. So I ask God. Why my life is so different from the life you promised in the Bible? I couldn't have, I couldn't enjoy, I couldn't have joy and peace in my heart. 
could it happen? At that time, God told me to just seek God. So when I prayed to God, I just focused on seeking God for several months. Heavenly Father, I need you. I want to see you. I want to uh, listen to you. I want to be hugged by you, impressed. I want to hear from you. I need you. I crowd out to God. One day, when I prayed to God, God told me, Abraham Joe, I was always with you. Especially reminding me of some Bible verses. I'll be always with you and even to the end of this world. Isaiah 43.2 Okay, would you read, sorry? Okay. Okay. Through the God's word, God told me to be he you know, to be always with me. I already knew that person. This time God clearly talked to me. When I listened to him, something inside uh, happened. God gave me, uh, gave, uh, gave me a face. I can believe that. So I can uh, have a, some sense of God's presence. This is a great experience to me. Since then, I continue to pray and uh, praise God and uh, praise, uh, giving thanks to God for God's presence in me, among, uh, in me. When I pray to God, this changed my prayer life so, detail, uh, so differently. Even my Christian life was changed so differently. Because I have a uh, strong conviction that God is uh, always with me, especially when I pray to God. This gives much joy for my prayer life. It is very difficult. It was very difficult for me to spend much time on praying to God. People, people, this. After this, actually, my prayer is the very sweet. I enjoy praying to God. I always pray to God. From the morning to evening. Moment by moment. 
When I go somewhere, when I miss something, I can pray to God. Because I know God is always with me. God is listening to me. So I have already great expectation to, uh, to be able to experience God. Sometimes uh, I face something I didn't expect. During those uh, several days in Cambodia, I got seriously. I got sick. So even though I'm, I, I am sick, I can enjoy. I'm full of joy. So proper prayer is to communicate with God. With the strong conviction. And number two, true and proper prayer is to seek God, God's will rather than our own will. Most people has focused on ourselves. Just we need to focus on God's will rather than our will. Which is better? Your will is better, God's will is better. Do you want your will will be done? Or oh, God's will will be done in your life. Who's will? Your will or God's will? Amen. I Amen. can understand. So, <coughs> the best example to seeking God's will is Jesus Christ. When Jesus uh, prayed to God uh, on the Mount of Olives, Jesus asked to God, to take up the suffering cup or the cup of suffering away from him. Three times. But he just wants God's will, not his own will. Why? Because actually the death Jesus is, uh, was facing is very difficult to Jesus. Why is so difficult, Jesus? Physically, suffering is not so much a big deal. Jesus experienced for the first time in his life through the his death. Jesus experiencing being forsaken by God. Jesus and God has a good relationship and fellowship. They love each other so much. And and Never being separated from God. Always God pleased with Jesus. Jesus prayed to God and God listened to him. 
Jesus has full joy and the heavenly father has full joy. Because of our sin. God punished Jesus Christ. God shook him. This is the most difficult experience to Jesus. Imagine when you separate from your best friend and your family. Imagine when your friends neglect you and appreciate you. How do you fear? Jesus faced the experience that kind of suffering because of you. So difficult to Jesus. Separation from God is the most difficult to Jesus. Without his death, we, we cannot come to close, come to God. God cannot accept you. Jesus died on the cross for us. So God is always welcome you. When we come close to God, God will, please, God will be pleased to you because of Jesus Christ. So when Jesus was facing his death, so he prayed to God three times, not once. Heavenly Father, take this cup of suffering from me. Take away from me. But I don't want to seek my will, but I seek your will. This is the best example. Our prayer is not seeking our own will. Powerful prayer is seeking God. Whenever you face difficulties and problems, we usually want to solve the problem easily and fast. So we don't, uh, we don't, we shouldn't uh, do like that. When you, uh, when you face difficulties and problems, we, we don't just ask God to solve this problem. Ask God, what's your will? What's the, your perfect will for me? What do you want to accomplish for me through this difficult situation? Just seek God's will. Heavenly Father, I want to your will be done, will be done, uh, your will be done in my life. Actually, the most important things in a prayer, a prayer is not getting something from God, but experiencing God Himself. Just seek God, His will, uh, seek, uh, just seek God's will in your prayer. God will give you whatever you ask God. Through and powerful prayer is to seeking God's will, not 
our own will. Okay, Romao ku jet prayer, my men jet yung. Amen. Number three, proper prayer is to pray with the face. Without face, we cannot please God. Trusting the most important to relationship and communication. We want to have a good communication and relationship. We should have a trust. Uh, when a child talk with his father without trusting, how uh, does it the father appear? But then by young men of cone, cone the young man took The father should feel very sad. If a child talks with a uh, trusting and loving heart, father will be pleased and uh, willing to give something for him. Like Likewise, wise, when we pray to God with the faith that God is always with us and uh, listen to us. And even give answers to our prayer. This this will please God so much and God will give answers to your prayer. We will uh, face, we, will, uh, we can please God. How can you have the faith? How can you pray to God with the faith? Just to try to communicate with God through prayer and the, uh, the Bible. When you continue to pray uh, with the Bible, God can give a strong face to you. And when God gives you a strong face to you about your prayer, you can pray with the face. You can pray uh, to God with faith. God will uh, be pleased with you and uh, willing to bless you. Since 2001, I always think about Cambodia. Or I think of all of you. During the conference in Cambodia, even in Korea, I really want to use conference to become a wonderful conference. Many people join together and enjoy God's presence and loving, uh, loving the fellows among you. I want to see you worship God joyfully. I want to see you have a loving fellowship among your friends. Even from other provinces. I, I want to see even you listen to God. You can see God's wonderful plan for your life. Even much fun time among you. Now, now uh, people, Sianokubiri, you have free time, uh, half a day. 
ก็ท่านมายืนในกระปงซ้ำคือยืนละเอียดนี้คือยืนอันมีเรียนนี่คือยืนตั้งสมบัติกาคนี้ I only think about how to develop youth c o n f e r e n c e for the best way จำแต่ยังก็ตาเธอไม่จะไปไอสันวัดยุบชนคือยุสันวัดมูแต่ละอ้อมพอด Even I always think about how to bless Cambodia to become Jesus country, Bible country, mission country. Jesus Cambodia. So someday, several years ago, God gave some gave some ideas about raising funds for Cambodia mission. So God gave some ideas about for Cambodia. So I continue to pray to God about that. And read the Bible. And through the Bible, God told me. I am willing to support. God told me I am willing to support you, Abraham Joe. Oh, Abraham Joe, Don't worry. Just trust me. So, so I can pray to God with a strong faith. By the year 2030, I want to raise from one million dollars for Cambodia mission. Please remember. Amen. Please, actually, I can, I cannot do. Only God can do. God will do. Please be with me in your through your prayer. Some know you must come to me at the end. Amen. Actually, next year, by the next year, 2023, I really want to raise from 100,000 dollars for Cambodia mission. From Korea, only half, 50,000 dollars. From Cambodia, $50,000. Is it possible? Okay, just to pray for this. I'm in charge of raising $50,000 by the end of the, uh, next year in Korea. Say it's in charge of raising fifty thousand dollars in in Cambodia. Okay. 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 You you are witness. Okay. So when you got some idea from God. When you face something difficult, when you need, you have something need. Just pray and read the Bible. Continuously. And you can uh, hear from God. And you can hear from God. God will give strong face to you. Just to pray with your strong face. God will please. God will be pleased with your prayer with face. Just pray with your strong face. Is to pray together with one mind in Christ. Matthew 18, 
Ok, nhầm án đọc bằng bấy, đọc bằng bấy mà thấy Nhầm phép nó khí chìa bà gọt thả Bà nẹ rõ khí chọn tốc ở vây ở vây nợ phần đấy Nú nâng trời chọn tốc nợ thân xua đài Hai bà sài ở vây ở vây nợ phần đấy Nú có nâng sài Nú nâng trời sài nợ thân xua đài Đọc bằng bốn môi tiết Nhầm phép nó khí thả Bà sân chìa miền bì nẹ Nơi khăn nông bụt nẹ rõ khăn nìa Prôm priêng khăn nìa nơi phần đấy Pi đầm nạ ở vấy đã kê chàng xôm Có đòi nụ nâng ban xâm rách đó kê Ông Pi bè vô bày đà khăn nhóm Đã công nơi thản xù mà phấy Thế bất cần lại nà Đã miên Pi rư bày nẹ rõ chùm Chìa mùi khăn nìa Đòi nơi chùm mùi khăn nhóm Nước nhóm có nơi còn đau chẳng nào mà nẹ rõ cái nền đài. Amen. Chị đi. You are Bible teacher. Yeah, amen. So, yeah, explain. Explain. What the, what, actually, Jesus gave us wonderful promise of our prayer. Phong Phra Su Ban Bong Rien Pi Ka Son Di Ya Rồi bỏ prea đọc bông phô ôn như thế nào cái nền. When we gather together, in the name of Jesus Christ, Jesus always be there. Jesus is with you now. How can we know? Because of His promise. When we gather together, Jesus will be there. Even in your hometown. In your uh, church. Any place. Especially even during youth conference. When we pray to, uh, pray to God with the same heart uh, together, Jesus surely promised He'll give answers to our prayer. Praying together with one heart is the most of, uh, one of the most powerful prayer. Actually, when, uh, actually, I was the I, I came I, I uh, came from very poor farming country in Korea. Only 15, 150 families uh, lived, uh, lived there. And very poor, and not immoral. When we, we, we came from the school, we, when we came from school, uh, up all, uh, village uh, friend and uh, down village friend fighting always. Uh, and they did something bad. Who didn't? In my religion, oh, uh, people. Someday, a soldier, a Korean soldier, Christians, uh, visit my family, uh, my hometown. And they, they actually uh, helped uh, my uh, church. They they always, they always had prayed to reach out all middle school and high school students in my hometown. They have a strong conviction that uh, it's God's will to reach everybody in the village. Korean soldier Christians, they are Sunday school teacher at the time. They, uh, whenever they meet, uh, met together, they always spend uh, more than one hour uh, for praying for students and for the village people, villagers. They they after five years, all, stand, all students attend the church. Still now, 80% of villagers uh, uh, 
are Christians. My uh, hometown totally changed. Almost 150 students, 30 people uh, became uh, full-time uh, workers for God. Because I saw God's great work in my hometown, I dedicated my life to God. So, oh, praying together is the most powerful. Two people, three people, we can uh, move God. Even two people, three people prayed for God together. You can, you can see many great things in your life. You can change your family. You can change your, uh, the family of your friends. You can change your church. You can change your village. You can change your uh, campus. You can change the whole Cambodia. We can change it. So pray to God. So we, 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 we have the great uh, privilege to see God's wonderful work for us and for the Cambodia through the power prayer. So, what's the power prayer? Four points. One is that we pray, uh, we pray to God with a strong conviction that God is with us and He is uh, willing to listen to us. Number two, number two, seek God's will, not our own will. Number three, pray with a strong face. And finally, we pray together with one heart. What do you want to change? Do you want to change your life? Do you want to change your family? Do you want to change your, family? your friends? Do you want? Do you want to change Cambodia? Do you want to change Cambodia? Do you want to change Cambodia? How can you change? Tell me, mate. Okay, through the uh, powerful prayer, especially pray. Praying together. Whenever you meet together, spend at least enough time on praying together. Now it's, the, it's time for us to uh, apply. You already know what is the power prayer. How can we pray? So now we, still, we, are, uh, we can uh, gather together and we can pray together. Okay, okay we, we, we just to pray uh, to bless Cambodia. You know the situations of Cambodia. Also pray for Cambodia in uh, provinces. Bless Cambodia. We, uh, we seek God and we ask God to bless Cambodia. And bless, we, seek, uh, we pray to God to bless our church. Our pastor becomes strong. Our church members are, uh, become strong. Please pray for Sarah and me. Okay. Yeah, yeah. 
and especially raise from one million dollars for Cambodia. Oh, at the time, a million dollars of that cannot be uh, people and up. Without your prayer, it, it cannot happen. But I mean, at the time, can you understand? Yeah. Okay. Please pray and be leaders. Okay. okay. Let's let's go to uh, our Father God. Okay. At the time, the organizer. God is uh, either you and God is uh, listening to you. Okay, first to start, you pray, uh, we do give thanks and praising God. Okay, Heavenly Father, thank you for this wonderful time with the brothers and sisters here. Thank you for your wonderful blessings and love toward us. Thank you for being your presence among us. Heavenly Father, thank you for listening to our prayer. Uh, we can pray to you with great joy. Heavenly Father, bless our brothers and sisters so that they can have a strong conviction and a strong faith. Heavenly Father, let them experience you in, through their prayer life. Heavenly Father, we want to bless Cambodia. You promised whether we, whenever we gather together, you will be there and we pray together. We are two people, three people. You will uh, give answers to our prayer uh, according to your promise. I can pray to you with strong conviction. Heavenly Father, bless Cambodia to become Jesus' country and Bible country, mission country. Heavenly Father, let all people in Cambodia have uh, at least one opportunity, one opportunity to hear about you, hear about the gospel so that they can come to you. And until you find all your lost people throughout the whole areas in Cambodia, Heavenly Father, I want to see someday every Christian, many Christians, and all your lost people gather together, worship you and praise you with great joy, Heavenly Father. It's a place Cambodia, so all Christians spend time on studying and praying to you. Heavenly Father, teach them, understand the Bible in a meaningful way so that they can obey and experience you and your Bible. Heavenly Father, continue to bless Cambodia and also bless Cambodia so that Cambodia can spend a million people and thousands of people, thousands and thousands of people to go overseas for serving you. Heavenly Father, country bless and also bless the all churches in provinces. I nearly want to see the pastors become strong in his family and in his marriage life and his children and all church members become strong and so that they can enjoy your presence and uh, ex you and you know, experience you, Heavenly Father, God bless. Heavenly Father, let's uh, uh, bless God. Okay, let's pray for yourself. Okay, let's pray for youth conference. For the remaining uh, time, God bless you and so that you can experience God. Okay, especially think about your prayer request and pray. God is ready to give answers to you. How wonderful opportunity we come close to God and give an, uh, get answers from Him. Pray for yourself and your friends and for a youth conference, even next youth conference, a wonderful youth conference. Pray with your small voice, okay? With your voice. God nearly want to hear from you. Okay, let's go. Heavenly Father, thank you for this wonderful time. So we are come to encourage our brothers and sisters to you. Heavenly Father, bless them. And open their hearts so that they can see you and they can listen to you. Heavenly Father, I nearly want to see them blessed by you. And I want to see them experience you, your rich blessings. Heavenly Father, whenever they pray to you, they will give answers to them. Heavenly Father, also bless the youth conference. I commit youth conference unto your almighty hand. Continue to bless and use and use for your kingdom and your glory. Heavenly Father, 
Heavenly Father, thank you for your presence among us. Thank you for your wonderful message for us. We nearly want to experience in you in our daily life. Especially through prayer. Heavenly Father, bless all my brothers and sisters here so that they can experience you. And continue to bless for your kingdom and glory. When they pray to you and individually and uh, as a group, give answers their prayer according to your promise. Also bless this conference. Bless all pastors and church members in provinces in Phnom Penh. Thank you for your wonderful love. Thank you for your great power. Thank you for your faithfulness. I commit my brothers, sisters here, and all pastors and all church members. All Christians in Cambodia, in missionary and CCC, all to your Almighty. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Okay, Akon. Chân trân chăm, chăm.